If I got a penny every time somebody asked me, Orestes, what's the best outreach method to land cooperating clients? I'd probably be a millionaire by now. I'm not gonna lie to you. So, is there a best outreach method to land 6K clients, 4K clients, 2K clients, or retainers? That's what I wanna answer today. So look, a lot of cooperating gurus will try to convince you there's a secret outreach method that if you use it, you're gonna, you're gonna land a client. But the reason they do that is to confuse you. So you buy their overly saturated course. Bro, that's what everybody's doing out there. If you've been in the game for more than two days, for more than two seconds, you know what I'm talking about. You've probably bought these courses. You've probably bought these crappy ass fucking courses where they promise you the moon and they don't even, you don't even get anything. They promise you to land a 10K client and you, in two days, for example, you, you, they promise you to land a 10K client in 30 days. You're there for 90 days and you haven't even landed a 1K client. So that's, that's, that's what probably happens with a lot of people. So the truth is the outreach method you pick will only work if you make it work. It doesn't matter if you pick Instagram, email, Upwork, or even send printed letters to your out to your prospect's mailbox. It doesn't matter. It doesn't matter. It doesn't matter. Every outreach method can work if you make it work. If you become the best at it. But when you switch from one outreach method to another, you don't really give yourself the time to master each one. Bro, think about it. Let's say let's say you go you try out try Instagram. Okay? Let's say you try Instagram. You do it for two weeks. You you kind of start getting the hang of it. You're getting a few replies, you're getting a bit of this, you're getting a bit of that. And then you're going you're switching and you're going to email. And it's like it's like you took you made progress, and then you stop the progress. It's like, for example, playing a video game, starting a character, upgrading him to level 10, and then starting a new character with a new game. Does that make any sense? Why, Why would you do that? Why would you do that? So, that's what I was thinking. Okay, I was like, let me try everything, and I'll just lay, nail down on, on the one thing that works. But wrong. That's not... That's not how things work, my friend. If you want to become great at something, for example, an outreach method, it has to be the only thing you're practicing. If you don't do this, this is the equivalent of having a goal to become a professional athlete, but practicing a dozen sports at the same time. Bro, just imagine doing basketball and football, boxing, tennis, and swimming, and running, and this and that at the same time. And then you're gonna become world class at anything. Bro, are, is this gonna happen? No, you're gonna become average at everything at max. Maybe not even average. Maybe not even average Bro, it's it's it, it kills me. It's it's crazy how people think nowadays and This is one of the biggest reasons that kept me a broke operator for 9 to 12 months straight I saw somebody land a client with email. I was like, let me let me send some emails. Let me type some emails I saw somebody succeed with Upwork. I was like Okay, let me make a profile and I start applying for jobs. And this kept on going. And that's why I didn't land any clients for for a lot of months. For a lot of months. And that's why I was stuck in college. I was stuck doing things I didn't want to do. Pleasing people I don't want to do. Being surrounded by people I didn't want to be surrounded with. And the list goes on and on. So, if I were to give you one tip. Okay, if you want to land premium clients as fast as humanly possible. Find one outreach method, stick with that specific outreach method until you land your client. And that's the best way to land your first or next premium cooperating client. So if you found this valuable, make sure to subscribe and I'll see you in the next one. Peace.